everybody. I just want to give you guys an update. Today's an exciting day. Today is our due date. So that's exciting. It's July 19th. And yeah, we are 10 weeks, 2 days old. So yeah. Mommy's big gal. Look at that mommy's big gal. Yeah. We went to the doctor today. He weighs 6 pounds, 13.7 ounces. And he's still 19 inches long. He hasn't grown since last Friday. But that's okay because he's gaining weight. Uh, we learned a lot at the doctor's office today. We asked a lot of questions, and she gave us a lot of advice. So we are allowed to, when we feed him a bottle, we don't have to do in the weird sideline position. We can feed him like a normal baby. So that was exciting news. And Alex is like, I've been doing it for a couple days anyway, so yeah. But uh, yeah, so we were also given the go-ahead to go ahead with... Um, the go-ahead to go-ahead. Sorry, that sounded weird. I have been given the go-ahead to breastfeed every time. And then if he still seems hungry, to offer him a bottle. So we have breastfed kind of two and a half times today. He didn't quite finish earlier. He puked. I'm not sure what was going on. I think he was bearing down trying to poop. But then um, he fed a little bit more later. So we're just trying that. We're still trying to stick to the every three-hour schedule, though. She did recommend that. So, yeah, we just went through our second outfit in five minutes with a blowout. So, yeah. Mommy changed her tushy butt. I changed her tushy butt. He's wide awake. He has this little gouge on his cheek. I had to trim his nails last night because he totally gouged himself. I noticed it when I got home. He was still bleeding. But it's healing. Uh, the doctor said he's doing really good. With the breastfeeding, we can keep going until he stops gaining weight. So, when we go back to the doctor in two weeks, if he's still steadily gaining weight, then we're good to continue. Which is great for me. It makes my life so much easier, you guys. Like, so much easier. So, what little bit of milk I had in my fridge, I put in the freezer. And... Yeah, I am able to sustain him. <sighs> Excuse me, I haven't slept really. I think I've had like four hours of sleep total in the past 48 hours. I don't know. I'm exhausted. I'm going to try to get some rest. But this little guy last night had really bad reflux and needed to be held the whole night. So, Mommy didn't get to sleep. But that's okay because he's just the cutest little thing in the world and he's totally worth it. But, yeah, the doctor's office was good. She said we can take him to restaurants if we want to go out to dinner. We can take him to, like, Walmart and Target and Kroger. But she said, you know, no, like, big events. Like, don't take him to the fair. Don't take him to the zoo. Don't take him, like, to walks downtown. You know what I mean? Like, there's a mental health awareness walk coming up. Can't go to that. Um, things like that, which I'm totally good with. So, we went to Walmart today. And... We just got a few things we needed for him. Nothing big. But yeah, we're doing great. It's just kind of neat to think that I would have been, you know, I was due today. So I would have been having a baby today and stuck in the hospital being miserable and bleeding and in pain. And instead I'm at home chilling, breastfeeding my little guy. So life is awesome. That's today's update, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.